a new game, Apex Legend Mobile. Everyone was waiting for it. Everyone was saying like, oh, when it gonna be released? Yes, okay. So, uh, for me, as competitive player, as COD Mobile competitive player, and uh, recent PUBG Mobile competitive player as well, I have some information that will or may help you inside the game because in case you rush inside the game like just coming from COD Mobile or PUBG you're gonna be totally lost and I used to play this game on PC a little bit like for like 20 days or 30 days something so I have small information may help you let's jump into the breadth range and I'll see you there the thing that I want to talk about in Apex Legend is really different from all games it's the movements you can't like do COD Mobile uh, movements on Apex Legend and like expect to go uh, well you need to do its own movements and tactics and for my advice to you guys if you want to play and uh, be good at close range fights the best tactics you can do is try to hide your head try not to take uh, headshot damage because it's the most uh, it will take a lot of your HP. So for from like uh, personal advice, my advice to you in close range fights, you need to do something tactics. I used to do in PUBG Mobile a lot of time ago. It's try to be right and left, and that's uh, I'm gonna show you right now how to do it. Let's see it in action. Like this tactic, when you do this in front of enemy, it's like impossible to take your headshot if it's like uh, sorry if it's like uh, ultra close range, you know. If you're fighting with them, sorry about my idea. If you're fighting with them like extreme close range, the first thing you need to do is like moving your your uh, movement circle right and left, and at the same time you need to crouch. This will give you like extreme good uh, maneuvers against the enemies. While you're doing this, my advice to you is try to have fire as well. It's like it's not extreme, it's easy, and Reloading. it will give you a lot of advantage. Or we have something else you can use as well. It's like slide shoot, slide shoot, slide shoot tactics. And this is like good, but like I still prefer the crouch one. But you can do this. Plant some shots like that, plant some shots like that. That's it. Second thing I want to talk about it's slides and slide cancel. How to do this in Apex Legend? It's extreme easy and it's very effective because you show when your enemy you slide on the right side, you cancel it, you slide on the left side, or you approach it from the right side, you cancel, slide look right, left side, flanking him, killing him easily. How to do this? First, you need to move your joystick forward to the right side or the left side where you want to show your enemy you slide into, and when you're gonna cancel it, just uh, press on the joystick, take it to the uh, back, press back, the, press the slide button back and then slide to the way you want to go let's see it in action for example i want to, i want to show my enemy i'm um, sliding right side there we go i cancel moved left just again you see it is very effective trust me my like opinion the flat line is one of the most powerful weapons in the game and the fastest to kill in my opinion into mid-range to long range Let's, let me show you why I think this. Just watch this. The damage is lagging through the dick. Reloading. You can take like absolute good. Reloading. That not even trying though. That's Reloading. Reloading. And there is something like a lot of people doesn't know I want to talk about. It's called the perks. Each champion you have, each legend you have, it has perks you can use and you can take advantage of it. For example, my main is uh, Bangalore. For Pistols to details, artillery. I can do it perks, all. You have the you call. What's, what's, what are those? Let's explain a little bit. For example, the perks. Uh, let's go perks. Like a couple of things your champion can do and you could benefit from them for example you have the turn back you have win, uh, winning reload uh, put your enemies 
arm, arm stealer and miss soldier each one will give you something to uh, take advantage of the enemy after responding you obtain plus button but shield and weapon based on the blah 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 after knocking uh, down target your reload speed will be increased by 10% you can apply 2-3 like quick perks to help you inside the fights and you have the finishers finishers when you finish an enemy the finish move you'll uh, receive something for example for me I did this taking down enemy with the finisher restore all shields plus if uh, refills ammo for your weapon, that's like a huge advantage you can take it from your enemies. Uh, actual weapons, weapons inside the game. There's like uh, different uh, like uh, weapons, different weapons inside the game. It's not like God Mobile. It's really close to uh, to PUBG Mobile if you uh, think about it. You have first the air drop weapons. Weapons you have. Uh, Carver is like uh, the most OB sniper inside this game. You have Whiskey with the shotgun, uh, Spitfire is like full auto LMG, and so OB as fuck. And you have the recoil snipers and the MR as well. Uh, you have the heavy ammo weapons, I call them. It's like normal ARs inside the game. You have the energy weapons. Something people don't know about the energy weapons. It's so obvious, fuck. But you know how you, you need to know how to use them as well. And you have uh, light ammo weapons. It's like combine of LMGs and pistols. And last and least, it's uh, shotguns. And we reached the end of part one. If you like this video, guys, please don't forget to like. Sub to my channel if you're not. Uh, write in the comments if you want part 2 of this video I will explain a lot of the game inside the games close range uh, fights, mid range fights and a lot of things uh, like it would help you inside the game as a beginner thank you guys for watching I really appreciate it stay safe and see you again later peace out